Hello dear all, I am Santosh Bhav and welcome to channel Learn Easy by Sandhya Bhav. Here we will see all information about the chapter expansion formula. Also we will see thoroughly how the expansion formula derived. So let's start our video. Now see the expansion formula chapter 5 class 8 mathematics. Here in this video we will see just overlook of this chapter. You know in the previous standard we have studied these formulas which are these in the bracket a plus b bracket square equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square then second in the bracket a minus b bracket square equal to a square minus 2ab plus b square and third one in the bracket a plus b and in the second bracket a minus b that equal to a square minus b square so these are all standard identities that we have studied in the previous standard now in this video or in this chapter we will study all these formulas these are the expansions formula and first one is in the bracket x plus a and second bracket x plus b see here what is the difference here variable one variable is common and other variable is different so this is different from the standard identities then second one a plus b bracket q previously we have studied bracket square now here bracket q and a minus b here is a plus b and here a minus b bracket q and last one a plus b plus c three variables are there and bracket square all these expansion formula we will learn in this video so let's start with our first formula now see this this is our first formula in the bracket x plus a and second bracket x plus b then how to solve just multiply each term each term to the second bracket so multiply x to this second bracket x plus b then plus sign is plus here a multiplied by x plus b then solve this you will get x square x into x that is x square then plus x into b x b this bracket is completed sign is plus write it plus a into x that is a x then a into b that is a b so if we combine the like terms which are the like terms see here x square is as it is then we can take x from this common from these two terms if we take x common there will be b plus a and outside bracket x there is x is common so take x out outside the bracket in the bracket there will be b and this a then plus a b as it is if we simplify this or rearrange we will get x square plus in the bracket write a plus a first a plus b outside bracket x plus a b so this will be the expansion form of this expansion this this will be the expansion form so x plus a into second bracket x plus b that will be equal to x square plus a in the bracket a plus b in the bracket outside bracket x plus a b so this will be the expansion form of this x plus a and x plus b this formula we will use in different ways or in different examples so this formula can be derived by using the area area of a square and a rectangle see if there is one square let's its side side be x and length and breadth are equal for the square if we add some length here b length b here added here in this direction and length a is added in this direction then this will be the area so 
first we have calculated this x into x that is this is area then this is also now this is a rectangle because this side is x and this side is b so this area first area will be x square then this area will be area of triangle area of uh, rectangle is equal to length into breadth are you getting here a1 a1 will be x into x that will be x into x that will be x square then this a2 i will write here a2 this a3 and this a4 here a2 will be this length x and this breadth b so x into b that will be the xb then a3 a3 will be this length is a see here and this length is b see here so it will be the a into b that is ab and last one a4 will be this is this length is a and this length is x so it will be the a into x that is ax so these are the four areas if we combine or add these we can write here total area of this rectangle means this length this length is x plus b and this length is x plus a if we take the multiplication of this we must get total area and total area is summation of this all areas so total area total area equal to x plus a in the bracket and second bracket x plus b are you getting and that is equal to this a1 plus a2 plus a3 plus a4 so if we add this we get x square plus xb plus ab plus ax that is similar to this one means x square and we can take x common from these two terms and bracket in the bracket a plus b outside bracket x and ab the last term we are getting the same expansion same expansion but here we are use we have used this area concept thus this expansion is very useful while solving different problems now let's see the next expansion now see the second expansion of this a plus b bracket cube a plus b bracket cube here we can write as a plus b then second bracket a plus b and third bracket a plus b are you getting that is the same meaning of this a plus b bracket q now here see a plus b and they, these two brackets are there so we can combine these that a plus b or we can write here a plus b bracket square that is the same meaning and we know the expansion of this a plus b we have seen in the last standard we can write here directly a plus b and a plus b bracket square is a square plus 2ab plus b square this is the expansion of this a plus b bracket square now multiply each term by a and multiply each term by b so expansion will be a into bracket a square plus 2ab plus b square then plus sign b into this bracket again a square plus 2ab plus b square now expand this a into a square that is a cube then plus 2ab into a that is 2a square b see there a is there here is also a a into a will be a square and b as it is plus this b square into a that will be the ab square then plus sign b into a square that is b a square then plus sign 
b into 2ab see here here is b here is also b it will become b square so 2a as it is and b square then b into b square is b cube then combine the like terms see a cube is a single term right here a cube then see here a square b there is also a square b a square means a square b that is same these two terms are like so combine these 2 plus 1 that will be 3 and a square b as it is then a b square here is also a b square these two terms are like terms so combine these 2 plus 1 that will be 3 a b square are you getting then remaining term is b cube so write b cube as it is so this will be the expansion of a plus b bracket cube that will be the equal to a cube plus 3 a square b plus 3 a b square plus b cube see carefully how the expansion is done how the formula is a and b two variables are there and bracket cube so write a cube and b cube lastly then it is cube so write three coefficient then a square b and three coefficient a b square so this is a simple way to memorize this formula also this formula is also useful we will use this formula while solving the practice set in the next video now see the next expansion of a minus b bracket cube now see the expansion of a minus b bracket cube so procedure is same a minus b bracket cube that is equal to three brackets will be there a minus b second bracket a minus b and third bracket a minus b now see here again it is same similar to a minus b and this a minus b a minus b that will be the a minus b bracket square and we know the expansion of this bracket so we will write here a minus b in the bracket a minus b bracket square is a square minus 2ab plus b square this is the expansion of this bracket then multiply each term by a and multiply each term by b so a into bracket this a square minus 2ab plus b square then here sign is minus bracket complete sign is minus so put minus b in the bracket second bracket a square minus 2ab plus b square now solve this a into a square that is a cube then minus sign is there so minus a into 2ab means minus minus 2a square b then here is plus sign so write plus a into b square that is a b square then here see here is minus sign put minus b into a square that is b a square then minus and minus that will become plus multiplication of 2 minus sign is always plus b into 2ab that will be the 2a b square see this b and this b become b square then minus and plus become minus b into b square that will be the b cube minus b cube now combine the like terms which are the like terms see a cube is single so write a cube as it is then a square b here is also a square b here is also a square b here is minus 2 and there is minus 1 so it will become minus 3 a square b now see a b square here is a b square and here is also a b square here is plus 2 here is plus 1 so it becomes 3 a b square and remaining term is minus b cube minus b cube so this will be the expansion form of this a minus b bracket cube i will write here a minus b bracket cube that will equal to a cube minus 3 a square b plus 3ab square minus bq so this is a formula 
और एक्सपांशन फॉर्म ऑफ दिस ए माइनस बी ब्रैकेट क्यू सी यर ए एंड बी टू वेरिएबल्स आर देयर बट साइन इज माइनस इफ द साइन इज माइनस देन क्यूब ऑफ दैट टर्म इज ऑलवेज माइनस दैट्स वाई ए साइन इज प्लस प्लस ए सो ए क्यूब इज प्लस बट फॉर बी क्यूब इट इज माइनस सो बी क्यूब इज माइनस दे इट इज क्यूब सो राइट थ्री को इपिशंट एंड स्क्वेयर ऑफ फर्स्ट टर्म ए स्क्वेयर एंड मल्टीप्लाई दिस माइनस बी सो इट विल यूज माइनस थ्री ए स्क्वेयर बी एंड थ्री को इपिशंट ए सिंगल एंड माइनस बी स्क्वेयर तो माइनस बी स्क्वेयर इज माइनस बी इंटू माइनस बी दैट बिकम्स प्लस सो देर इज प्लस साइन स्क्वेयर ऑफ बी दैट्स वाई इट बिकम्स प्लस सो दिस इज अ सिंपल वे टू मेमोराइज फॉर्म एंड दिस फॉर्म्यूला वी विल यूज फॉर सॉल्विंग द प्रैक्टिस सेट नाउ सी द लास्ट वन एक्सपांशन नाउ सी द एक्सपांशन ऑफ इन द ब्रैकेट ए प्लस बी प्लस सी ब्रैकेट स्क्वेयर सी हियर देर आर थ्री वेरिएबल्स सो लेट्स स्टार्ट a plus b plus c bracket square is nothing but a plus b plus c and second bracket a plus b plus c then multiply each term of the second bracket by first term of first bracket then second term then third term so expand this a into bracket a plus b plus c then plus sign plus b into bracket this second bracket a plus b plus c and similarly c in the bracket a plus b plus c then solve this a into a that is a square then a into b that is ab and a into c that is ac then plus b into a i'll write here a first or b then b into b b square and b into c that is bc Then plus a into c that is ac plus c into b that is bc and c into c that is c square. Always write the variables in the sequence a b c. That is the same meaning. Now a square is single, b square is single, c square is single. So write these squares term first. So a square plus b square. Plus c square. We have covered these three terms. Then combine the like terms. Which are the like terms? A B here is. Then here is also A B. There are two A B terms. So one A B plus one A B that will be the two A B. Two A B. Now A C here is also. C here is A C. And one more A C here. Two A C. So right here, two AC, and remaining which are BC and BC. There are two terms BC, so right here, two BC. Thus, this is the expansion of A plus B plus C bracket square. So, right here, A plus B plus C bracket square is equal to. It is square. So write the square of each term, A square plus B square plus C square. Then There is a two in the expansion, so write two and then multiplication of each terms. A B plus two this A C plus two this B C. Let's cover all terms. So this is the simple way to memorize this formula. So this is the expansion of A plus B plus C bracket square. This formula also we will use while solving the practice set in the next video. Thus we have covered. all the basic information of this expansion formula in the next video we will see the practice set and in this practice set we will use this formula to solve the different examples this is all for this video we will meet again in our next video do learn do enjoy thank you